was sat having my breakfast, the next thing I knew, I knew straight away that something had become lodged in the back of my throat. I heard him coughing really badly and I went over to him and I asked him if he was choking and he nodded. I couldn't breathe, I couldn't, I couldn't speak and it's just that moment of panic that comes across you. We thought it was a good idea for the school to take part in the St John Ambulance Big First Aid lesson because we believe that it's a vital life skill for children. In the Big First Aid lesson we learnt what to do if somebody was choking so I gave him a couple of back slaps and I said I was going to call the ambulance. And just before he did, he just did a couple of more slaps on the back and thankfully that, that's, what, that's what saved me. Jack is a wonderful student, but he must have been listening extra hard that day because the very next day he was able to use all of his knowledge, understanding and skills to save his dad's life and we couldn't be prouder. I think the work that St John Ambulance does is, is absolutely invaluable. Indirectly, they saved my life that, that day. One of the things I have learnt as well is that currently first aid is only taught in 24% of schools at the moment, I believe it should be 100%. Jack is a very funny, mature little boy, he's only nine years old and um, the fact that he was able to save Keith on that day was amazing. From my point of view it's, it's something that I could never ever thank Jack enough for what he did to me. I felt amazing when I knew my dad was going to be okay because he means everything to me. <laughs>